the current biggest payloads that we've sent to the surface of Mars are in the one ton range with the Curiosity and Perseverance rovers. When we're looking at crew missions, we're going to be much, much larger payloads. So we need a new landing system. Technologies like Lofted and HiEd will allow us to land those types of cargo. I'm Emily Judd. I'm the current lead for trades and assessments for the Lunar Architecture team. And we are working on our return to the moon as part of the Artemis program. A lot of our work on the Lunar Architecture team is about not only our return to the moon, but returning to the moon in a more sustainable manner, preparing for longer duration missions, and also testing out those technologies and mission operations as we prepare for Mars. So we're not just going to the moon to explore the moon, we're going to the moon to prepare for Mars and beyond. Mars does have an atmosphere, although it's much thinner than Earth's atmosphere. So we still have that challenging mission phase of, of entering through that atmosphere and, and getting our payloads down to the surface, investing in technologies that will allow us to land safely, keep the payload and keep the cargo and the crew safe during that, that mission phase is very important. Expanding our presence even further into the solar system than we've ever gone before is so exciting to me. Getting to work on that type of mission planning so early in my career is really thrilling. Just the idea that we are challenging ourselves to go further than we've ever gone before. We, we get to try out what's new and figure out the best way to actually make this happen.